WTF. Oh, okay. Got it. Okay. <laughs>exciting one for me. I started my YouTube channel a few months ago and I've been recording on um, either Nathan's iPhone or on our iPad which has been honestly totally fine. It's just I wanted to start doing more um, vlogs and taking the camera out and I don't always have Nathan with me with his iPhone and the iPad is just really wobbly and it doesn't take the smoothest videos especially if you're on the go. So Drum roll. Ta -da! I ordered a camera. So this is my Mother's Day slash birthday gift. Thank you, Nathan. You're not welcome. <laughs> and today's video is gonna be me doing an unboxing of my new camera. So the camera I got is the Canon EOS M100. And I also got a few little accessories in here that I'll unbox with you guys too. Woo! All right. For those of you who are new to my channel, um, I like to film a lot of things with my kiddos. Isla, who's two and a half, and Leo, who's gonna be eight months old tomorrow. He's growing up so fast. And also Nathan likes to get on the camera once in a while and film fun little outings he does with Isla. Um, we are gonna be doing um, some videos on our backyard reno kind of what we've been up to with that and also things that we do around the house so if that's something you think you'd be into make sure you click on the subscribe button at the bottom here so you can see all our other videos I'll also be filming some day in the life soon and um, just some weekend vlogs and stuff like that so yeah thank you all right so let's get started I brought this little weapon here. I probably shouldn't be allowed to do this with a knife, but. All right. Oh my God. So cute. And I don't even have it out of the box yet. So here it is in the box. The Canon EOS M100. Cute. I should probably stop saying it's cute. It's probably not the most descriptive word to describe this camera, but that's just a word that I use quite often. Okay, sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. Okay, so first thing, this big mama of a user manual. I have a lot of reading to do. Um, I'm just gonna be completely honest. I'm probably just gonna watch a bunch of YouTube videos um, to learn how to use this camera. But this is good to have still. I don't really want to read user manuals. That's probably why most of the stuff that I build, like furniture or toys, end up like falling apart. Anyway, moving on. Online photo album, register now. Up to 10 gigs free, what? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Ooh. It's cute. It's like a little strap, let's see. Aw. If so, that's pretty cool, because I actually was gonna buy one. I'm glad I didn't. Yeah. It says Canon and EOS. Sorry, that's upside down. Next. Oh. Okay, I just have to say I feel so fancy that I have this camera. Like, I feel way too cool. <laughs> Like, look at this. Uh, I don't even know what the heck this is for. No, I'm just kidding. It's the lens. But, like, I have a lot of learning to do because, honestly, I've never had 
any camera ever, nothing like this. So yeah, here's the lens. So this is the zoom lens, 15 to 45 milliliter. Five milliliter. 15 to 45 millimeter. Twist like to zoom, awesome. I'm just gonna take a sip of coffee because I really need it. Oh, All right, I just had to like run down. Nathan's painting in our mud room and the <laughs> roller like fell off of the broomstick and like tumbled down the stairs all over him. So yeah, anyways, I'm back. Lens, moving on. This is the little battery, I think. Yeah, it's cool. Tiny little guy. Oh, this is the charger for the battery. Okay, so I just kind of plug this into the wall. And then the battery's just gonna sit in there. That's nice, I like it's not too big. It's not like a big long cord attached to it. Okay. Okay. And now the pièce de résistance. I don't know why I'm saying that with like a weird accent. Bubble wrap. Okay, just offhand, like this honestly is a little heavier than I expected it to be. And it doesn't even have a lens in it, but oh my god. This is so nice. Like look, I can't believe this is mine. I'm just gonna give you a little 360. There's a little dials at the top, power button. Sorry, it's a little bit out of focus, but I think that's the shoot button, like to take pictures. On off. Oh no, that's the record button. Wow. Okay, I'm literally gonna be using this to record. I probably should understand where the record button is or I'm gonna be... <laughs> okay. Um, okay, there's like a little thumb grip. I saw in some reviews that like, <clears throat> one of the things people didn't like about this camera was that it didn't really have a grip. But there is this little groove here. I don't know if you can see. Yeah. I don't know. I think that's kind of comfortable. But I know what they mean. Like usually there's like a little, I don't know, groove here to grip onto, especially if you're like vlogging this way. Wow. I honestly just feel way too cool. But there's like texture to it so it doesn't feel too slippery. But I know you can buy a little kind of case that just goes around the bottom here that has a little groove in it. Oh, there you go. Twists. It's like a little button that releases the cat. And then my fancy lens. I honestly like feel like this is the most fragile thing ever. I'm like scared to touch it. <laughs> I can't. WTF. Oh, okay, got it. Okay, yeah, now it's like even heavier. Okay, I keep like cutting my head out, sorry. Anyways, this is the important thing to see anyway. Continue on, there's a little clip. I feel like I could lose this so easily. Oh my God, Isla, you're so cute. Let me just take a picture. I have a strong feeling that I probably didn't do this right. There's like this big flap sticking out here and I was left with these two pieces that I took off and I don't really know where they go yet, but I'll figure it out. Anyway, here it is. Here's my little neck strap. Cool. 
I don't know if I'll keep this on, but just wanted to show you. So next is my little accessories, which are in this bag. I'd probably do this without a knife, but that wouldn't be as fun. First thing, I got a memory card. So I got the 64 gig SanDisk Extreme Pro. So again, I just looked up at, I Googled like what memory card to get for this camera. And this one was one of the recommendations and it was actually a really good price. I think it was like 35 bucks. So that's not bad. Some of them are like $100 or more. But yeah, so this one says that it, is good for like a camera that records in 4k I think mine yeah this one only goes up to 1080p so it should be good okay I'm gonna open it and there it is in its little case so my last accessory is this whoops, tripod, so it just fell, oh, okay, cool, this is actually a lot longer than I expected it to be, huh, okay, it's actually pretty tall. So I'll be using this probably for like my sit down videos or if I just want to place it down outside. Let me see how sturdy it feels. Yeah, it honestly feels like really good. Okay. So yay. Let's spin her on. So, okay, I'm probably going to take that strap off like ASAP. It's already bothering me. But anyway, good to have. So this is probably how I'm going to use this the most often. So at least this will help me like extend the reach just to get more in the frame. There it is. Um, behind me so you can see what's going on. And I forgot to even show the best part about this is the flip up screen here so when I'm vlogging and out and about um, I could see what's in my screen here make sure that I'm in focus and everything that I want behind me is in the screen so yeah cool this is like honestly pretty heavy and it's probably gonna <laughs> give me some uh, big deltoids going on and biceps but yeah cool I like the way this looks. I'll do it this way. And this grip is like super rubbery and sticky. Not sticky, but you know what I mean. Grippy. Is that a word? So I feel like I'm not gonna, it's not gonna slip out of my hand. I don't know, maybe if I'm like really sweaty in the summer, but honestly, I don't think it'll be a problem. So I think this is gonna be the last video that I record. On on the iPhone or the iPad. So that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you give it a good old thumbs up. I hope everybody has a good long weekend. I know I will. I'll be putting this baby to the test, so keep a lookout for my new videos. Thanks everyone, see you later.